Hello YouTube, uh, here I am again with the unreliable uh, Bad Design HHR. Well, here's something new. It's not really a problem. Well, it's just a stupid design from Chevrolet. So if you're trying to jumpstart somebody else's vehicle or you're trying to get a jump on this car, uh, I don't know if you if you own one, you probably realize that the battery's in the back. So the only positive lead that you have is this one here. And there's this negative. Chevy thinks that you're gonna be able to clamp your your uh, cables to this little short. It's only like a quarter inch ground. See, they even put a sticker here so you know that's ground. Uh, well, I got a fix for that. Uh, what I did is uh, you can either go on eBay or your hardware store, maybe Gringers, and you get this uh, lug, and uh, I call it a ground lug. Uh, so what I'm going to do is right here where I marked an X, I'm going to drill a hole, and it's going to stand up because when you close your hood, this will be in the way. So I'm going to install it. And it's gonna be going downward, so a little bit will stick up. If anything, you'll have to grind it, grind the rest off, whatever sticks up. But um, that way, you can clamp your negative right here, and your positive is a little easier because it's a, it's like about an inch long, even though it's a little short. Up oh, there goes my cover. I'll get it later. So uh, I'm gonna try to record this as best as I can. I don't have a GoPro or. A, one of those fancy uh, glasses with the camera yet. So what I'm gonna do here is uh, first I'm gonna grind off the paint. I'm using this this grinding. You can use a grinder if you got one, an angle grinder. It's gonna take off the paint. Let me put it on speed two. bottom <sighs> that way when when you put that that lug on it's got a good uh, conductor there's no paint blocking that that uh, negative charge on it so now I'm gonna use this drill bit I'm not sure what size is it uh, but you, you make sure you compare it to to the to the lug make sure it's not a lot bigger or a lot smaller so here I'm gonna drill about right there There we go. Blow it out. Get all these little metal shavings. I might want to get a vacuum instead. I should have used the vacuum. So now, here's my lug. So, just bear with me. I'm using one hand to do this because I'm recording with my phone. So, your lug. We'll come up from the bottom and let me see if I can do this single handed. Let me put this let me put this here and this here or here. So now okay, this might be a guide for somebody that only has one hand, you never know. Okay, so put my my lock washer, my locking washer, and my nut on top. Yeah. There we go.
voila now now you have a negative uh, lug right there you have a ground lug so now you can get your cables clamp onto this of course you have to tighten it I just did it finger tight right now but I'll tighten it up in a bit so don't forget to do that and now you have that and now you have your positive lug right here I dropped my red cap so I'll get it later but here's where it goes so basically you hook up your red to whoever's jumping you to their red and their black to this which is basically the, the car's body that's always um, negative I believe there's only like one brand of vehicle foreign vehicle maybe that the body is positive but I'm not sure what car that is but just be careful read your manual or do your research the majority of the cars the body is negative or black so like I said tighten this up now if for any reason this sticks out too far to where it'll hit on the hood for some reason which it shouldn't just get an angle grinder if you have one and grind this down and then you should be good but there's there's your there's your negative lug now easier a lot a lot easier than using this crap thanks Chevrolet find new roads huh yeah new roads to a tow truck or a mechanic shop yeah all right I hope this helps you guys out maybe this will make your life easier if you want to jump somebody or or if you they want to give you a jump uh, another tip don't think that under here is the negative these are both positive so if you're gonna like I said if you're gonna get a jump or, or give somebody a jump to here's your positive right here and if you do this that I'm doing this will be your negative lug here all right hope this helps you guys out makes your car a little better if you own one of these or if you want to do this for somebody else that always has issues with giving a jump or getting a jump uh, Thanks for watching.